My name is Deepak Dinikaran. My name is Mustafa Al Balushi. I'm a fourth year resident here in the uh, University of Alberta's Radiation Oncology Program. I'm a third year resident of the Cross Cancer Institute. One of the greatest things about our program is that we offer a middle ground for everything. So um, you have excellent exposure to research, academic excellence, and then there is excellent work life balance. My experience uh, in this center has been very positive so far because. Our staff are very approachable and very friendly. I never felt like I was uh, put on the spot or uh, I never felt like I could not ask certain questions that uh, I really needed clarified. Everybody learns radiation oncology in a different way. Our staff are very much cognizant of that and are very adaptable uh, to the way that best suits us. Our uh, physics department uh, and our former chair here, Gino Fallone, uh, was one of the ones that uh, pioneered uh, the MR LUNAC technology. Our program is uh, very unique in that uh, residents get plenty of time for working on their research projects and also there is um, flexibility uh, during the week or even you know on a single day there is uh, flexibility for in terms of uh, workload and also in terms of uh, getting time to do other um, activities uh, such as uh, studying and, and working on your projects. In radiation oncology, we know that cross compatibility and cross training with uh, the US is a very important uh, part of our Canadian training even, uh, if not for fellowships, also for uh, other job opportunities as well. Our residents have been uh, quite good at keeping up with not only their Canadian training and the physics exams, um, and of course the Royal College, but also the uh, US exams as well. Uh, so we pass on a lot of knowledge from year to year on how to do well in those exams. We have very good pass rates because of uh, that being a feature of our program. We uh, do have the funding that we need to be able to get our trainees to have these experiences in different centers and in different uh, conferences and learning environments.